Thank you. And I just want to mention that I'm blessed to be here with my parents, um, Dr. Millie DeRitchie and former Bayer Judge John DeRitchie. My mother is a historian and she used to write for Jeopardy, but one of the things that she wrote about was the grist mill, and I hope I get this right or else I'm going to hear about it, but <laughs> this is one of the major ports that people used to work in that came from Holland that basically settled this area, correct, Mother? Okay. So, 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 and, and Gilly, we use your mother's report right. in all our grand submissions. Yes. So, so, so it should have been so very helpful. So my mom, my mom said it's got a little memory, and I think we're going to do another, um, another version of that to, you know, to mark this, um, this event once it's all opened. She promised. She signed up for that. So, so um, it really was an economic. Um, it's what started this whole area. So when people say why do you preserve it, in my opinion, the word we're preserving, and the county executive said, our history and something we cannot rebuild, but it also reminds us of where we came from and, and our proud roots of, of our ancestors. So so I'm very lucky to have grown up with that background. And I want to thank the county executive and my fellow legislators because we do have a good amount of money in the capital plan that um, I'm so happy to hear we're going to be allocating. And we can't wait to see the um, final version of this. When you said it was an endangered building, my kids remind me of that when we drive by. They're like, Mom, that's the building we're <laughs> trying to see. But what it really is, is it's the heart and soul of this man right here, Howard and Roz Crockett. It takes the heart and soul into everything with his beautiful wife. And you know, if we didn't have you, um, you need that one person to really push, and you have been the push from day one, and you're a pleasure to work with. You make it fun, and um, if it wasn't for you, this would not be happening, I have no doubt. So I thank you for your um, You know how I like history? This is a little side note, but the gentleman who's protecting you today, Daryl Haynes, the history of 1986 is he was our homecoming king. And, um, <laughs> and I absolutely love 